Time now to connect the dots when we make the news make sense. Beaches across the south are expecting crowds this week as college students head to the coast for spring break. This is video you're looking at right here from South Florida where you can see the beach is already pretty busy, pretty packed as well. However, spring break won't be the stereotypical party that college students are expecting. Spring break could look very different this year. Let's connect the dots. Last year, when spring break hit right as the pandemic was exploding, pictures of college students crowded on beaches quickly made headlines. In an effort to avoid a repeat this year, some colleges are taking an extraordinary step, canceling spring break. Now, that doesn't mean kids won't get any time off. Instead, places like the University of South Carolina are scattering days off throughout the semester. Other schools are trying to offer students incentives to avoid the urge to travel. And by incentives, we mean cold, hard cash. The University of California at Davis is offering $75 staycation grants to students staying in town. Other schools are offering on-campus events like pool parties and petting zoos to try to discourage travel. Despite these efforts, travel experts still think there'll be plenty of college kids packing beaches across the country, and they might have some company this year. Now that older Americans are getting vaccinated, they're starting to travel more. So you can expect to see some senior citizens alongside the college seniors on those beaches. And that is Connecting the Dots.